Hello guys, in this video I will show you ultimate optimization software which works for all games and it have more than 2500 tweaks um, a lot of manual settings and small game boosters so um, in description you can get it so it's named Elysium V2 and you will get this folder and we only need now use Elysium V2 and run as administrator also before then you do this you must have disabled UAC it's in description also because it will don't work without this so you need to log in I will give you login you will see this and here you can read about Elysium and what's the features here and what updates I want to do and we will start with performance here you can see this is a lot of settings so we will start with performance this tab mean you will optimize your performance and it's really simple um, here is every time the tweak you will enable and if you click it back it will revert okay but still I recommend you using restore point before you will do any changes with this application because here are a lot of tweaks and maybe not all can revert so definitely use restore point so also here is configs you can have to download my config in description so you don't must every time um, do it again you will see the values you set so here the manual settings are because you can test the values to get maximum performance because for example um, this for your PC don't must work good but for others can so definitely it's good to set save your settings and load them and we will start tweaking so disable all collecting time divers this is just power saving feature here set everything to zero processor tweaks, power miser tweaks, power tweaks Mult microsoft multimedia tweaks and here it will create a batch file in your disk C so click MSI mode and here you can see msi.bat run it as administrator and now click disable USB idle wait until this will hide and run this as administrator So this enable MSI mode for other drivers and this will set um, USB for lower input delay. Here Q8 priority set it to 1, tweak VXD set to 1, resource policy, advanced explorer tweaks, parent tweaks, diagnostic tweaks, loader tweaks, network priorities, fix MRT, continuous tweaks, advanced prefetch and system tweaks this will disable prefetch not enable okay so yep it will disable now we will go optimize latency lmt set it to 2500 clock rate set to zero here it will don't work because um, this is like disabled and this is enabled so disable this system interval one debug pool interval 1000 latency priority free and guys this is my settings okay so I recommend you really test every the values like for example latency and set them I don't know increase the value degrees and test what's work for you because this worked for me and I also testing more it so yeah enable max frame latency enable fixed latency tolerance transition latency this works good on 1 or on 5 latency hint percent 100 latency Q size I recommend you using it on 32 but you can lower value can have um, can do better per latency so yeah but I don't recommend you go like here 5 under 10 but you can also test it so I will use 32 global data Q size and this use on 20 Disable exit latency, disable power idle, tweak lazy mode, fix latency values, tweak frame buffer, 
priority separation and here you can see performance this is like balanced and lowest latency so if you prefer lowest latency set like this if performance like this flux set to zero and this is advanced this is testing feature so i recommend you really test it and after everything tweak just try this high performance burst latency this can really improve performance and low latency a lot and high priority this will set um, mouse keyboard and optimize their values to get lowest latency possible so this is really good experimental tcp size i recommend you using it i for me it worked good on 60 ppm size um, ppm size set to 32 also and here i recommend you 60 or 32 usb hub size if you want lowest delay i recommend you set it to lower value so for example 15 or 16 net power idle 100 okay this is just must have hit on 100 Amplified text file allocation size this is just directly tweaks latency timer here is just mix of everything but this is really experimental not like really working and really good okay enable hardware acceleration timestamp interval delay desktop switch timeout sample size zero here set one text contrast six gamma level max clear type level one multi offsets 15 um, for x afd 4000 local priority and here set it four here five six and seven also you can test one 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 and one this is also good settings enabled here this is nvidia tweak and now we go to full optimization and game mode here is few buttons but here is more than 2000 tweaks in these buttons okay so yeah this is the main tweak of this application so disable telemetry definitely we don't need telemetry optimized performance here are a lot of tweaks and a lot of mine tweaks which i never show in my youtube videos and never uh, see them so Yep, reduce pink, fix delay, reduce stutters, and priority tweaks. This set as well as to idle, and now game mode. Priority tweak, enable, and here it can do this because um, for some reason the right clan block it, but disable boost and lower memory size by. And here you can um, select your how much you want lower um, memory size from some processes. I said it's DVM Explorer and SVT out. I recommend you set it 500. You can also increase it, but test what's best for you. Okay. Now here is BIOS overclock and uh, lithium powered plan. So in BIOS. Um, you will get this folder and it's in here BIOS here is also guide AMD and Intel tweaks and here is how to overclock your monitor to get more Hertz for example if you have 60 Hertz you can get 75 and power plan and I will show you now how to implement it so open CMD open command.txt paste it here and now just you can select performance and latency I will select, select for example latency drag it here and click enter and you can see it's imported now go to control panel go to power options and here find Elysium low latency and just select it and that's all also in description is free version of this application so it don't work really good like this but it's also really good tweaker application so i hope you like this video subscribe my channel and go to the description get this elysium v2 bye